Hello and welcome to Solfeld. In this video, I will show you how to set child control via the web portal and the available options. To get to the web portal, go to the Solfeld homepage and select the login section. Alternatively, you can do this via the program or the free parents app. At the web portal login, we now enter the parent email address and the password we set during the installation on the children's device. Make sure the browser does not save the password if your children also use this PC. After logging in, we will see the start page of the web portal. On the top right, we can select the specific device and the particular user in the case of Windows. Just a tip, there is also a detailed manual, which can be reached by clicking on the three dots next to the user selection. There, individual areas of the web portal have been explained again in detail. At the top of the start page, we see a short status of the currently selected device along with the time spent today. Let's first have a look at the device limit. Setting limits here applies to the total time of the Windows PC or Android device. You can use the blocking times to specify when use should not be allowed. Use the forced breaks feature to request breaks after a given time. The daily, weekly, and monthly limits can be combined. For example, you can specify that a maximum of 14 hours is allowed per week but not more than 3 hours per day. In child control, the shorter limit always applies and overrides another one. Even if there may still be some time left over from a daily limit, an active blocking time will override anything else. These time limits can be applied to the device, any program or app, and even to individual websites, such as YouTube. To do so, select the programs or web filter area, and select an entry or add them. In the detail view, you can choose between different access levels. With allowed, you allow this entry, even if it is blocked by a category or age filter. Allowed plus gives you the option always to allow certain apps or websites. Use allowed plus to stop the device time counter or even provide bonus time. For example, you have the option to reward the use of a learning app with a bonus time voucher. With the access, type blocked, you block an entry, and with a time limit, you can set times for only this app or website similar to the device limit. Use one of the five groups to set a standard limit for multiple apps or websites, such as a group of games. If this group time is then expired, no member from this group can be started anymore without affecting the rest of the PC. In the security section, you can set some Android or Windows operating system restrictions. However, it usually does not matter for the security of the program itself. For example, child control cannot be terminated via the Windows Task Manager, not even with admin rights. In the Logs section, you can see how long which application and which website has been running. The history gives information about what exactly happened on this PC. You can also restrict individual entries directly from this section. You can have all this data sent to up to two different email addresses on a daily or weekly basis via the email report. In the settings section, you can set options that are the same for all users of a Windows PC. Here you can, for example, adjust the pre-warnings or define what should happen when a total limit is in effect. If you want to transfer a created configuration to another PC, you can use the import slash export function. A popular feature is our TAN time vouchers. A TAN is a six-digit number that is assigned to an extension time. You define how long this extension time is in the TAN list. You then only have to tell the child this six-digit TAN number. The child enters this as a password replacement and receives the specified extension time once. These time vouchers are convenient for distributing additional time. So, that was a rough overview of the web portal without really being able to address all the features. Just have a look around the web portal, 
and also the manual, maybe you will discover one or the other exciting feature. As always, please get in touch with us if you have any questions. We are happy to help. Thanks for watching.